Hello everyone, Chris O'Dell here from Datsusara. I'm very happy to get to show you one of our newer additions to the family of bags today. Uh, this is going to be the Pure Yoga Bag. Um, so as you can see, it's a bit of a smaller version of, let's say, um, our Warrior of Peace bag, which is this big guy which you can hold, you know, you could use it as a weapons bag or a yoga bag. Long story behind that, check out the other video. Um, but this is a much, much, much bigger bag. However, if you were just doing yoga or doing something a, light, a little bit lighter um, gear-wise, you really don't probably need the large Warrior of Peace bag. So that's why we made the, uh, the pure yoga bag. This is what we're calling it. You could obviously use it for anything you want. That's what we're calling it. Uh, this is made, no, oh, getting a little dusty out here. This is made out of our, uh, our new blend of fabric, which is actually 30% stronger than our old material. It's a 55% hemp, 45% organic cotton. Uh, it turns out blending the hemp with some organic cotton allowed us to make the weave a little bit tighter, gave it a little bit of flexibility, and somehow when the two work together, every test we've done comes out at least 30% stronger uh, and more durable in general. So I think these things are going to last a much longer time, still be pretty environmentally friendly. Uh, you know, adding the organic cotton in there doesn't change a whole lot except for a little more water usage and depending upon where you live uh, or where you're growing the hemp rather, uh, that may not be such a big problem, which is the case with ours. So anyhow, you got your pure yoga bag here. Um, again, sorry I'm getting a little dirty here just showing you, but you've got a pocket up front here. Uh, and that is, you can put a water bottle in here, our standard, uh, our new standard water bottles, the insulated ones, fit in there just fine with a little bit of room to spare. Um, you use that for whatever else you want as well, of course. On the back, <clears throat> on the back, we have a couple of flat pockets here. You could probably fit like, you know, like a t-shirt or something. It's kind of thin, thin white stuff, uh, you know, clothing, which, you know, most people, it's probably what they're wearing in yoga anyway. Or you could, of course, you're wearing something bigger. You could take out your mat, and when you practice, doing your practice, then you uh, put your clothes in the center here. Now, what I've got in here is uh, a, what is it? It's brand is Yolo Ha, which I highly recommend them. As you can see, it's kind of like a natural cork top. I love this yoga mat. Um, if we ever did any, I'd probably do something like that. Great mats. Anyhow, it is a, uh, let's see, 72 inches by 24 wide. Now, even though the bag itself here is 27 wide, I would say what you want to do is uh, keep your mats to no more than about 24. I mean, I've got a little bit of room, but it starts getting hard to stuff it in there. And with this one, since it's a thicker mat with the cork and everything, I got to kind of make sure it's compact in there just to get it in this. And it works out great that way. And that is a slightly larger yoga mat than a lot of people would use. Um, so I think for normal mats, it's going to fit just fine. Should work really good. Um, I suppose you could wear it across your body, probably a little easier. So that's the general size. I'm five foot nine, if it gives you any idea. But uh, yeah, it's just a more simple, uh, simple, plain, more of a yoga bag and could use it for other stuff. But that is the what we are calling the pure yoga bag. Hope you guys like it.